Hey YouTube, welcome back to the channel. For today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at my latest pickup, the Vans New School. Now I'm sure you've seen this sneaker all over your TikTok and your Instagram feed, and even your YouTube shorts. And after seeing them over and over again, I decided to give these a chance and caught myself a pair. And I do honestly believe that these have the potential to be the sneaker of summer 2023, replacing the Panda Dunks. Packaging wise, the sneaker comes in the standard Vans box with Vans branding on top. I did go ahead and get these in a size 13, which is my true to size. Now upon unboxing these sneakers, they are very identical to the Imran Potato Vans that released last year. The only difference is that there is no Imran Potato branding on these, but in terms of look, they look very similar to those Imran Potato Vans that released, I think last year or the year before last. But yeah, they share a lot of similarities. Now, when looking at the sneaker off the bat, the standout features are gonna be the puffy tongue, the fat laces, and even the exaggerated toe box. If I had to describe these, I would basically say they are Vans old school on steroids. The puffy tongue, the fat laces, the exaggerated toe box, the tab on the heel, the wide shape, it's just an old school on steroids. The van symbol is also has like a 3D effect. Normally it's flat on the old school, where on these it protrudes out just a little bit to give off like a 3D effect. When it comes to sizing, I would recommend going through the size. I did see a lot of different opinions on sizing, but in my opinion, they do fit through the size. I normally wear a size 13, I have wide feet and I went through the size and they fit perfect. So if I had to recommend size, I would go through the size. If you enjoyed the video, please give me a like, comment and subscribe. It does go a long way. Stay tuned for the on feet portion and let me know down in the comments below how do you feel about the Vans New School. Do you think it's a good sneaker? Do you think it's a bad sneaker? Do you think it's overhyped? Do you think it's played out? In my opinion, it's a good solid sneaker for a good solid price. Until next time, happy Friday, peace.